The main tab of the Athos app is the workout tab. In this tab, you are able to start your workout, which is a free form workout or a facility pushed program. The first that we will go through is Freeform. By clicking on the red Freeform button, this brings us to the Freeform workout page in which you can start your workout. Take note of the core icon on the upper right hand corner that shows us that a core is indeed connected to the device and also in a garment. There will be a red exclamation point here if there is not a core paired and a core is not in the garment. To start the workout, click the play button in the middle of the screen and see that you can choose any exercises from our list of exercises. You can also create an exercise, which we will get to next. The first exercise that we are going to do is a goblet squat. I'm going to select goblet squat in the middle of the screen. It will bring us to the live view. The front of the body is on the left hand side of the app, while the back side of the body is on the right hand side of the app. Come in and do a goblet squat and you will see live view working. If we look at the screen, there are multiple colors that you see. Light activations are light blue. As we get deeper into the squat, you can see that the muscles are activating more. They transition from yellow to orange and the maximum activation is a red. So on this rep, on the third rep, we're going to have the athlete activate their glutes as much as possible by cueing them to push the floor away and we will see those oranges and reds coming into play. After hitting done in live view, we get taken back to the main workout page. On this page, we can add a new exercise or repeat the same movement. If I click add exercise at the bottom, it brings us back to the exercise list. If there's an exercise that you would like to do, such as a glute bridge, you can also type in glute and you will see the exercises that have glute in them. So on this exercise, we're going to do glute bridge. When you type in an exercise, it actually brings you not automatically to the live view screen, but to a start screen that allows you to get set up for the exercise. Now that the athlete is ready, we're going to come down to the bottom and click start. We're going to have the athlete do multiple glute bridges, looking for those high activations of the glutes. This is a great exercise to also view the live view for some biofeedback. After the exercise is done, we click done at the bottom right hand side. Now in the last instance, we want to create our own exercise that doesn't exist in the Athos library. So we are going to come in and do single leg deadlifts. It is not in the Athos app, so we are going to type the exercise in and click in Create Exercise. Again, we have to come down because we manually entered the exercise and click Start. And in this example, we're going to do a single leg deadlift.